For WTSA News and for Brattleboro Community Television here on your Monday, April 25th, my name is Ian Kelly. These are the stories we're following at this hour. A Jamaica resident faces charges after a pre-dawn accident on Saturday. State police received a call reporting a person knocking on a door and an unknown vehicle in a driveway in the town of Jamaica. Investigation revealed Dennis Cobb was allegedly operating a vehicle on Route 30 and crashed into a garage. Cobb was released on a citation to appear in Vermont Superior Court, Wyndham Criminal Division, on May 3rd. The third and final discussion about Brattleboro's emergency medical changes will take place tomorrow night. Representatives from the Brattleboro Fire Department and Golden Cross Ambulance have already held two discussions about the changes set to go into effect on July 1st. Tomorrow night's discussion takes place at 6 at Brooks Memorial Library. The Vermont House this week will revisit the issue of rental housing safety. A Senate bill is up for action on the floor for Tuesday. Meanwhile, the Senate will consider a House bill that calls for hearing aids to be covered by insurance. Vermont's Agency of Agriculture is inviting forest product companies to apply for a forest products accelerator program. The program is for startup and seed stage companies from throughout North America that are commercializing new and improved products, services, and technology. Companies get expert advice and tools to build a market-validated business case model and operating plan. Along with con connections to industry players and resources, the application deadline is June 17th. Springfield police received reports of gunshots being heard around 3 a.m. on Saturday morning. Police say that they are looking for the person or persons responsible that were seen leaving the Valley Street area in a dark colored vehicle which traveled north toward Brook Road in Springfield. Anyone with information is being asked to contact the Springfield Police Department. WTSA Sports, a rough weekend for Boston and Tampa. Yandy Diaz had a homer as Tampa Bay beat Boston Sunday 5-2. Boston is at Toronto this evening. Nathan Avaldi on the mound for Boston. First pitch is at 7.07. Garrett Cole struck out nine as the Yankees rolled over Cleveland 10 to two on Sunday. The Yankees have an off day today before beginning a series with the Orioles in Baltimore tomorrow. And Eric Halla scored twice as the Bruins beat their old friends Montreal Canadiens yesterday five to three. For WTSA News, and for Brattleboro Community Television on your Monday, April 25th. Have a safe and tremendous day, everybody. My name is Ian Kelly.